So yeah. are you digging this SpaceX thing? Yeah, you know, and, and um, you know, with all thoughts of Elon Musk, and I have two different th uh, theories on that guy because he's crazy on one side, but genius on the other. I'm yeah. totally focused on it. I've been watching. I watched every single one of the first probably 200 launches of that because in the 80s, you know, when we were doing, you know, I, m one of my uh, specializations was flight mechanics and propulsion. And so mm -hmm. I'm looking at rockets and I wanted to work in the rocket business, right? Mm -hmm. And, uh, but the cost of space flight, was prohibitive because you know they're single use devices right and we would posit to our our professors back then and we said hey why don't we figure out how to land them like buck rogers did in the 30s you know and all these you know sci-fi things while you land and they say no nah, it's impossible you can never do it you can never control it and, and realistically back then with the speed of computers and the and the way the avionics worked they didn't have the ability to con to measure and control the surfaces needed to do that right. there just wasn't the computing horsepower to do it and so now there is and so when i first saw them trying to do it and failing spectacularly to begin with um i was transfixed by that and i read all the spacex books on it you know the, the history of spacex and fascinating to watch a private company go about doing that 